Hello, my name is Leo from Leo's Motor Ride. I want to show you uh, something how to test ignition coil. This is 2005 R12 GS. Um, when you have on your BMW uh, boxer bikes, let's say uh, rough idle, backfire, not power, maybe he dies sometime. Uh, so you want to consider checking your coil. And I will show quick how it's done. So basically what I usually use just a needle nose for uh, holding the coil. I got too many time shots from the spark. So that's for the safety. I have the BMW special tool for remove the coil. I'm using a small flat screwdriver for pulling the cover or anything I need. And then I took the original spark plug OEM and I just broke and cut the tip and that's make the actually spark to come stronger out instead staying in the the what do you call it the the whatever <laughs> okay so let's see so I remove the spark plug cover I'm taking the BMW special tool slide it in carefully sometimes you need to watch out not to break the connector, but you need to rotate it from side to side and move it. And while you move it, many times people break the tip here, so you need to watch out. It's no problem to disconnect it with the flat screwdriver, actually disconnect it and then move it is safer. But once you have the coil outside, stick coil, I'm going to put back the spark plug in. And you can see there's no tip. That's the whole tip. Okay, so turn the ignition on. Now, remember I said I don't want to hold the coil anymore. I got shot so many times. So I'm going to hold the coil. I'm going to start the bike now. You can clearly see there is no spark. Now I will touch and the spark kind of coming out, you see? Because I create more uh, contact with the ground and then he walks very very slow but if I go a little far and that's why I broke the tip you're gonna see in a second on the other side even if the spark plug far away it's still sparking very strong so this is a weak coil which doesn't uh, work and make the bike to to act that way with the you know like I said rough idle no power so I'm going to leave it now in the meantime because I'm going to change it. Let's go to the other side. So now I move the spark plug cover on the other side. And like I said earlier, what you can do with a small screwdriver, you take this wire out so you don't break the end of it. Take the tool, sometimes they are so tight, what I do is I move from side to side, try to free it and then I pull it out. And I'm gonna put it back in. Put my special tool spark plug. I'm gonna hold the coil again with my needle nose. We come close to the bolt and I'm going to start the bike again. And you will see now the spark are way bigger. I engage the motor. You can see the spark always there and it's very strong compared to the other side. So that means I have a bad coil on the left side and I'm going to change it. So thanks for watching. And this is just a quick tip. Right safe, thank you.